Beyonce! Beyonce is stepping out in her Western best at the 2024 iHeartRadio Music Awards. The singer turns heads at the 2024 iHeartRadio Music Awards on April 1st, where she is honored with the Innovator Award. For the event, held at the Dolby Theater in Los Angeles, Beyonce stays true to her current Cowboy Carter country theme, wearing a black leather set and matching cowboy hat with gold embellishments. After being introduced by Stevie Wonder and revealing that Stevie plays the harmonica on her cover of Jolene, Beyonce says this about being recognized as an innovator. Innovation starts with a dream. But then you have to execute that dream, and that road can be very bumpy. Being an innovator is seeing what everyone believes is impossible. Being an innovator often means being criticized, which often will test your mental strength. Being an innovator is leaning on faith and trusting that God will catch you and guide you. So, to all the record labels, every radio station, every award show, my hope is that we're more open to the joy and liberation that comes from enjoying art with no preconceived notions. And I want to dedicate this award to all the innovators who have dedicated their lives and their art to creating shifts. So thank you for your sacrifices, your powerful voices, and your dauntless spirits. She goes on to shout out her team, as well as daughter Blue Ivy, twins Sir and Rumi, and her husband Jay-Z. And thank you for my team at Parkwood. Y'all worked so hard. And I, I thank you from the bottom of my heart, my husband, my rock, my best friend, I love you. My three beautiful children who continue to be my inspiration and my biggest blessing. But the history-making moment doesn't stop there. As iHeartRadio notes in a press release, quote, her recent release of Texas Hold'em from her Cowboy Carter album is officially the first song in music history to simultaneously chart across U.S. pop, hot AC, AC, country, rhythmic, hip-hop, R&B, and AAA radio formats. They continue, It is the first song this year to reach number one in the U.S. and globally on all major sales and streaming platforms, also making her the first black female artist to reach number one on the Hot 100 with a country song. And the 42-year-old is expressing her gratitude for this moment in her career, writing in a March 19th Instagram post quote, I feel honored to be the first black woman with the number one single on the Hot Country Songs chart. That would not have happened without the outpouring of support from each and every one of you.